Hi guys and welcome to the second episode of uh, of this mapping tutorial series. Uh, as I promised, this, in this episode I'm gonna show you uh, how to use the Windows Movie Maker. Uh, it's uh, a bit uh, complex how to download it. Uh, watch, uh, there is a lot of video about uh, how to, to how to download uh, uh, Movie Maker, Windows Movie Maker. Uh, but most of the mappers use this, so I'm gonna show you this, but yeah, this is the most simple uh, thing. So, uh, you need to put uh, your files there. Uh, the paint.net file, not the paint.net files, uh, the normal files. So, uh, add videos and photos, as you see. Uh, go to your files and select like this. And he, uh, they are gonna, yeah, they are uh, together, right? Yes, they are together now. Okay, so like if you press, uh, you know, arrow, you can't move. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna show you the duration, uh, the air duration, because uh, the only thing you need to do uh, with these files is to. Uh, select the duration but because uh, you don't want uh, every file to be like 7 seconds because it's not good right so and uh, of course put a song so uh, press edit and duration and the first slide is uh, like 3 seconds I, I usually do that because you know the viewer need to realize uh, what's happening uh, and the uh, and the text files are usually four seconds. So the, he declared war in Germany. This is two second, and like all the butter slides, it's one second or uh, zero uh, point five. You can do zero point five with this. No, no, no. Wait, wait. My keyboard. Yes, with like this and you, you get the zero too but uh, but we want uh, one second here yes and we just do that one second one second one second Germany surrendered one second and they are making the treaty you can and yeah that's the end of the video okay so let's see Germany I will kill you Yes, Poland is attacking, but uh, you need to put animation. So, animation, select this one, and set to this, and apply to all, and you have the animation, right? So it's it looks much better, right? Yes. So the video is almost done. Video. <coughs> editing is not that hard actually and add music you can do that music and like I have a, a file for that and like like this I'll show you one more trick. If the song ends at the, uh, at you know, you can uh, split it and make the music volume at the end uh, more uh, quiet because. Uh, wait. Yes, like here. Split quieter, no, like this, and this one's like this, and <laughs> right. So, this is uh, for uh, so you want to save now. Uh, if you if you are not finished the project because it's long, you can save project as 
like but I'm not gonna do that now I'm just gonna save movie you click save movie uh, this is recommended setting recommended uh, for this project and uh, you save it here you call it whatever you want and it's saving uh, uh, it's gonna take a lot of time if it's a big file but it's not it's small let's watch it play So yeah, uh, pretty much that's all. If uh, <coughs> you can put with any song, you can download the song, you know. And then I wanted to show you one more thing uh, about the map. Uh, you know, uh, I'm gonna show you a little trick uh, how to make a map even more spectacular. You you, you select a background, paper background, or or stone background, or whatever you want like whatever um, for example uh, no this is not good for example like this like a paper and course turn off anti-aliasing and you do that you select a uh, uh, rubber and shadow and you just do that and it's mu it looks much uh, more spectacular right and you can map on it just leave this file there so that's all I wanted to show you uh, I hope you I hope hel I helped you a lot with this uh, you know with this mapping tutorial uh, we will meet in the next video, uh, in the next mapping video. So, bye.